I don't like this, dear. Go. I know you're doing the shirt. Go. This is Paint Life, and you should take pride in what you do for work and buy our new clothing line. This is Chris, the Idaho Painter. In this video, I'm going to show you a simple little trick how we take a bucket without a handle, and I'm going to convert it into a bucket with a handle. So stay tuned for this simple little trick. So these two gallon buckets, these are buckets that we have a lot of them. We got about 20 of them in our vehicles and we use them on a daily basis to do our cut-ins with. And these buckets typically have a white handle on them and the white handles wear out fairly fast and fall off. And a bucket without a white plastic handle on it is a very uncomfortable bucket because we're typically doing cut-ins for hours throughout the day. And once these handles would break and fall off, we would throw these buckets away. So I figured out this little trick and that's taken these five gallon buckets that we get our paint in that we're painting our exteriors with that we typically throw away at the end of the day. We use some of them in our vans but we're throwing a lot of them away. They actually have a white handle on them and you can take that white handle and put it right onto this bucket and now this bucket doesn't have to be thrown away. So here you go, here's a simple process. This bucket, all you gotta do is take the handle off right here and if you just take the bucket down bend it in, this handle will come loose. If your buckets like ours, these things are used quite a bit and they get a lot of paint built up on them, that handle's gotta slide over that so you can actually just trim this off right here. Just cut that and then this paint will just peel off around this handle, just like this. That paint will just come right off, just like that, and now that, that handle actually slide on to this wire frame for this handle. So I'm just gonna take the handle off this five gallon bucket now, and I'm gonna put it onto that bucket. So now, now I'm gonna begin removing this handle off this five gallon bucket right here, just by bending it down, and then push on that bucket to get it out. Just like that, now I got this handle right here, and I can slide this handle off here. I'm gonna bend the end of it right here so I can get the handle off. It's got a little curved bend on it right there and we gotta bend that curve with a pair of pliers to continue sliding it off. So I've now I got this thing off the one end. Now I'm just gonna take a pair of pliers and bend this wire right here so I can actually pull that handle off. That handle's gonna slide right off. So now in order to get the handle on to this wire frame, I've gotta bend this in just a little bit. I bent it just to make it a little bit straighter so I can actually slide that on. Now it slid on there. Now I just gotta bend it right back the way it was. Just make sure it matches the other side correctly. And then we can stick this handle right back on our bucket. So now I'm just gonna take and insert this handle right back into my bucket here. You have to bend the bucket just a little bit. It's plastic and flexible. Now it snapped right back in. Now my bucket has a new handle and it's gonna be a lot more comfortable. Hopefully you enjoyed this simple little trick of adding a new handle to the bucket and saving it from the landfill for a little bit longer. Simple little trick and saving this, this little hurted it or made it and I'll just bend this thing right here a little bit so I can get it off, get it out. Well, ho well hopefully, don't leave now. I got two more videos for you to watch and these are gonna help you paint your house a lot easier and a lot faster. And one of them right above me right here, and that's gonna teach you how to mask a roof line. And I got another video right over here, and that video is gonna show you how to operate an airless paint sprayer. And when you're done watching my videos, don't forget to subscribe by clicking on the red button right there, right there, to subscribe to my channel. It's free. Anytime you see that button in my videos, you can click on the button and I'll subscribe you or take you to my subscribe page where you can subscribe to my channel. And thanks again for watching my videos.